Chris DeFillion. Welcome to the LHS News 2 Morning Announcements. Today is Monday, November 2nd. Student Council will host its annual holiday food drive this week and next week. All high school and middle school students and staff are asked to participate. Written instructions and food collection bags have been distributed to advisors. Please help us in our effort to support those in need this holiday season. A representative from Maine College of Art will join us next Friday in Mrs. Platt's room. If you're interested in speaking to the representative of this school, please see Mr. Shea in guidance. Practice for both plays will be held every day this week directly after school. Practices are mandatory unless you have spoken to Mrs. Steinhauer and have been given permission to miss the day. On Tuesday, November 10th, next week, we will have a Veterans Day ceremony in the gymnasium at 1.30. Peter Corey, retired Brigadier General of the New Hampshire National Guard, will join us for the ceremony, complete with a presentation of colors and flag ceremony by the JROTC and a short performance by the LHS Chorus and Band. For more information, please contact Mrs. Ward. There will be a three-on-three -three basketball tournament at Profile High School on Sunday, November 8th. The deadline to register is tomorrow night, November 3rd. There's a registration fee of $10 per person or $40 per team. For more information and a list of rules, please visit the office. And now, here's a look at the Littleton forecast for today, courtesy of the WMUR weather station in Manchester, New Hampshire. Today, we will have partly cloudy skies with afternoon highs in the lower 50s. Clearing will continue through the evening with a lower overnight low of around 35 degrees. For tomorrow, the sunshine will continue with milder temperatures in the mid to upper 60s. We could see some scattered clouds later in the day, but mostly clear skies will join us again. Overnight lows will drop down into the 40s. Looking ahead, at Wednesday, you're in for more sunshine and steady temperatures, lingering in the mid-60s for a better part of your afternoon. That is all from the LHS News 2 weather, and now let's take a look at today in history. On this day, back in 1936, the BBC television service launched, become the world's first regular public television service, after a few months of switching between two different broadcasting systems, they discontinued broadcasting using the Baird electromechanical system and the BBC service was considered a success. The official range of the broadcasts were 25 miles, though in practice they could be picked up much farther away. On one occasion, New York RCA engineers were experimenting with the British TV set and picked up the signal. This has been your moment in history and that's all for us today. Have a great Monday.